Welcome back, friends. Today, we're having a conversation around structures and frameworks so that you can build your business on purpose, create the wealth that you would like to create in your life, and you do it through frameworks and structures. And just a caveat, even if you have right variables in your human design body graph, this is going to serve you. So stick with me as we have this conversation. Okay, if you're listening on the podcast, I do have some visuals that I'm going to be sharing today. So if you have time um, to, to pop over to the YouTube channel and, and check out this video, it, if you're a visual learner, that might be really good for you. Today's conversation is around structures and frameworks and the importance of this. So humans are in this human meat suit. It's a structure. We're here to have an experience. But we're here to be inside a structure. The universe, um, nature, everything is built on structures and frameworks. There's geometry and there is the, the, the Fibonacci sequence. It's a formula. Your human design body graph is a formula. And being inside that structure, you can transcend the structure, okay, and have an experience. However, it's the structure and the framework that allows the mechanical aspect of who you are and what you're designed to experience to be attracted into you, even if you're a manifester or what we would call an innovator in the BG5 terminology, you're still, um, you know, your, your system itself is closed and repelling, but there's still this magnetism that happens with your closed and repelling energy. Okay, so even if you're right variable, you will, you will have the opportunity to build structures and frameworks inside your business because structures and frameworks allow your people to move through a step by step process. Now for the express builders, manifesting generators, you're like, ooh, I don't really like step by step. Totally get that. We are designed to skip ahead. However, there's more often than not, we have to come back and actually complete the steps. And it's okay. You know, you creating a narrative around that and being very um, forceful of that narrative is going to create suffering. So relax into the fact that we all need structure, no matter if we're right variable or left variable, we need the structure to move forward. So I'm gonna share some visuals here and provide you with this, this movement forward, okay? So this is what I get to do in the Purpose Driven Wealth Formula. That's why I created um, that whole formula because it is, it's your formula. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna share my screen. Okay. So when we're looking at structures. What we want to do is we get, we're going to get lost in a sea of human design readers or um, human design analysts or tarot card readers or therapists or, or um, natural paths or um, fitness and nutrition. We're going to get lost in that sea if we don't have our own unique methodology, our own unique framework, and our own unique result from someone entering into our ecosystem. So your unique methodology is going to set you apart from the masses, okay? So we're gonna walk through this unique methodology so that you can lean into creating your own. And again, if you want help with this, if you wanna be able to take your human design body graph and infuse it into this process, that is what I get to do. That's the magic that I have in store for you inside the Purpose Driven Wealth Formula. All right, so I just need to now find my other, there we go. Okay, so the first thing that we wanna do is go into the what. Insights is the what, right? This is the information that you're gonna to provide to your client. So information is educational. However, it's also 
education isn't what we, we think it is. Education is actually helping people have a perception shift. So you want to look at, like, they have a problem and they want to move to a result. So what is the information that you can bring in your unique methodology to help your clients move from point A, which is the problem, to the end result? So this is the what. What is your education? What are you bringing your client? Step number two. It's the process, it's the transformation. This is the how. How are you going to uh, provide the transformation? It has to be measurable, directional, and cyclical, okay? So for me in the Purpose Driven Wealth Formula, the process that we go through, the transformation is number one, it's awareness. Number two, it's the internal shift. And number three, it is the aligned action. And then what happens is when you have a transformational process inside your unique methodology, what takes place is now it's templatized. That's really what your human design body graph is. It's your template. So now having this process that is measurable, directional, and cyclical, now you can take that and you can create tens of thousands of different businesses based off of this template. But the transformation from point A to point B allows for clients to go, oh, there's my pain point, and this is where I'm heading to. It has to be a direction. So why, why do they want to join your process? Why do they need your process? And again, it's usually around the four currencies, okay? And the four currencies are, you're gonna save them time, you're gonna save them time, uh, money, you're going to help them build relationships and it's gonna be on purpose. So if you can solve their pain point with information, transformation, and then show them exactly how they can you know, save time, money, create relationships and have purpose. This, my friends, this first three processes, three first three steps, that's massive for your people, okay? So always providing the visual. This is really important. This is the value visual. So clients are at a, at a pain point. You know, most of what happens with my clients is this. They are actually a commodity before they start working with me. And what I mean by that is they're dabbling. So they're not putting in much time or much effort. And it's actually costing them money. It's actually costing them to be a dabbler. Then we have people, you know, they're working, they're putting in a little bit of effort, or sorry, the workers that are putting in lots of effort, sorry. Um, this is actually costing them a lot of time, money, and effort as well because they're working inside their business. And what I mean by commodity here is you're signing up for all the free webinars. You're signing up for all the free PDFs. You are spending copious amounts of time learning and working and doing all the stuff inside your business. And you're actually, it's actually costing you time it's costing you relationships, it's costing you money, and it is costing you your purpose because your purpose is actually to be, you know, um, a, a step ahead of all of that stuff, okay? Where we begin to earn money and take our experience to the next level this is where we want to be. This is where all my clients want to be. They want to be premiums. They want to be considered experts where they're very focused. This is where you start to now multiply your money to the positive, okay? This is where you're mastering. This is where you're learning, trying, and testing. Influencers, this is where you're leveraged, okay? So you're going to leverage people. Um, so you're going to connect with people on different social media and leverage their audiences. Now, all of a sudden, you've six times your income. Not only are you an expert, but now you're leveraging, you're creating that influence. Now you have six times your income. 
And then the movement, this is really a, an effort, time and effort is actually suspended because you have so many people working for you and your income is 10 X. I will be honest with you. I am definitely not here in, in, in the movement uh, process yet. But I am dabbling in, I shouldn't say dabbling, I am in the three and six times X my income because I've mastered a system, I've mastered a process. I have created my own unique methodology and I have created relationships with people online to, to go and, and blend in my audience with their audience, their audience with my audience, okay? So these are things that you want to show your people as you're moving through your unique methodology. So now your proprietary process. So if they work your process, they will get the results. This is your uniqueness. This is where your unique process, this is where your unique human design shows up. This is where your unique skills show up. This tool will connect the psychology and connects to the emotions. And at the same time, lets the client stay in decision, okay? This is the proprietary process. They get to decide step by step by step in your process. Yes, this is for me. No, this isn't for me. So when we're working through the purpose-driven wealth formula, there are things that, that my clients have to decide. You know, are the, how are they going to, um, you know, present themselves out into the world? They get to choose platforms that they want to be on. Maybe they don't want to be on any platforms. Um, they get to choose um, how their creative process. I give frameworks and structures. Now they get to decide how they do this. So the proprietary process is this, I'm gonna provide the tools and the progression. The decision is always in the client's hands. And what I mean by that is this, they can either choose to, to implement um, a process in their life or not, and they get to choose what the result is that they want. That's the big thing here. So if you are building out a process, know that your client always has to be a choice, okay? And then again, the result is this story, style, delivery. You should be able to talk about your unique methodology, no matter what is happening. If you are on stage, if you are an author, um, in your social media posts, when you're talking with your friends. So this is the impact and the message you are providing to your clients. And again, it doesn't matter if you're a coach, consultant, author, speaker, you can share your methodology to anyone at any time because your process creates demand. So where you are now to where you want to be. So when I am doing my, my process in my business, I talk about that. I talk about my clients being overwhelmed. When they come to me, they're overwhelmed. They don't know how to start things. They don't know um, what they should actually be, be, be doing. Um, they feel like they have been, you know, chasing this hamster wheel for so long that they're scared to actually go forward. So what you get to do in your storytelling, in your style, and in your delivery, you're influencing the seven human desires, okay? In your marketing, um, you're always wanting to keep people at decision. So these desires include a desire for change, right? Do you want to stay at the same income for the rest of your life? Do you want to contribute? Do you want to have congruence in your life where you get to work the hours that you choose in your business because you are in alignment with your design? So here's what I'm going to say. I am a manifesting generator. I have three motors attached directly and indirectly to my throat. Guess what? I am in movement and action and manifestation a lot. And it's congruent with my design and I love it. Creating connections. I'm a one three. So I create connections. I break that bond. I create connections. I break that bond. How are you designed to connect? Control, control over the schedule. 
control over who you actually accept in as a client. Competence, this is where mastery is so important. Um, there are so, uh, so many myths indicating that, you know, that we shouldn't master things, especially as manifesting generators, that we should be multi-passionate and multi, um, multi-tasking. And that actually takes away from our competence. Okay, so competence comes from mastery. There will be a theme throughout your life. Lean into it, lean into it. And then the creative self-expression. Everybody wants to be able to express their uniqueness. So um, this particular video was here so that you can play around with. What is the unique methodology that you want to bring to your clients? My purpose-driven wealth formula, this is a process that I have been developing and tweaking and, and, and maturing through and with over the last few years. I see the power inside of it. The deeper you lean into the awareness of who you are, the awareness of who you're not, you make those internal shifts and then only take aligned action. Those three pillars allow for your human design formula to show up in the world so that you can earn the income that you desire. Okay? So play with this, lean into it. What's your unique methodology? You know, if you are a human design reader, know that you're going to get lost in tens of thousands of human design readers. And your, um, you know, being the uniqueness is going to be difficult in that world. If you are a tarot card reader, know that you are being lost in a sea of hundreds of thousands of tarot card readers. You're a therapist. You're getting lost inside all of that. We wanna take your unique methodology and put it on a pedestal and place it out into the world so that you can speak about it no matter who you're interacting with. So when you're, when you're interacting with people, you can have the conversation and go, hmm, and be able to really pinpoint, you know, Here's what I could help you with. You know, this is the process that could help you. Oh, that's so interesting that you said that because this is what I get to do for my clients. Now, all of a sudden, you've got them thinking, you've got them create, there, there's a demand being created for your process because there's 100,000 therapists out there, but it's your process. There's 100,000 um, fitness gurus out there, but it's your process that's gonna set you above and beyond, okay? So play with this. Again, if you're listening on the podcast, jump over to the YouTube channel and, and you, can, you can see the visual of this. Um, what else I wanna do is say that Mel Abraham was the creator of this particular, um, the word or the, the depiction that you saw there. And then I added in the human design stuff because that's really truly my mastery. So I wanted to give credit to him as well. When you're ready, I am here. Jump in, um, share this with whomever you can. Uh, get yourself into a process where my process is all about purpose-driven wealth. If that's where you wanna go, get yourself into that process. What is it that you desire? Do you, What is it that you want in your life? Really understand that. Do you want more time? Do you want better relationships, health, wealth, purpose? You get to make that decision. And once you know what kind of freedom you want in your life, then you'll know the coach that you want to interact with. All right, friends, enjoy. And uh, we will chat again. Thank you.